Welcome guys. Today I will be showing you how to fix a pretty annoying problem. This video is specifically for iOS users, especially when you have an iPhone 10 or 11. Since you don't have a home button anymore, you have this home bar, and basically whenever you're playing, your home bar as well as notifications center and control panel is active. And if you're a claw player, doesn't matter if you're a 3 or 4 or maybe a 6 finger claw player, and some of your buttons is very near to the top part of your screen. If you're in a very intense situation in game, where your fingers are moving everywhere, and all of a sudden you accidentally swipe down your notification center, or maybe your control panel and you die, because you didn't have the chance to get to fight, and get your shots. Now I'm going to show how to fix this on your iPhone. First, you go to your settings. Then go to accessibility. And you scroll all the way down till you see guided access. Click on that and switch it on. What you do now is set up a passcode. So you click passcode, and set guided access passcode. And if your phone has face ID, then you might enable that, as well. So you can disable guided access with face ID. And if you have an older iPhone like an iPhone 8 or older, you can unlock with touch ID as well. Never mind the time limits and accessibility shortcut. But make sure you turn display auto lock to never. So now when we go back to PUBG Mobile, all you have to do to enable guided access is triple click your power button. Or you can also ask Siri to enable it for you. Siri, enable guided access. Activating guided access. And for the first time you're gonna enable guided access. You will see here that you have option settings, where you have some options to allow or disable whenever you're in guided access mode. Simple as that. Now, no matter how much you swipe down or swipe up, you won't be able to exit the app or open notification center and control panel. And when guided access is enabled, your notifications won't appear on your screen, so you have nothing on your screen other than your game. And when you're done, all you have to do is double click to exit using Face ID. Or triple click to type in the passcode you set to end guided access. Simple as that. So that's basically it. Once you have this enabled, you won't have to worry about accidentally opening notification center. Or the control panel in the middle of the game. Let me know in the comments below if this has been a problem to you because this guided access was a huge lifesaver for me. That's all I got for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like and subscribe if you learned something from this video. Want to achieve zero recoil? Check out my full tutorial and sensitivity on how to get zero recoil like aimbot. Link in the description below.